How's it going everyone, Kov here. Had a few comments asking for a dribbling tutorial, so I'm going to give you a little one at the moment, because I will plan to do a controller uh, cam video with uh, some skill games for the next one. But I'm going to give you a little bit of a general thought process on what I do while dribbling. And I'd say one of my uh, number one tips starting it off is to let go of the sprint button and start trying to aim to do small circles and small rotations without being too jittery on the left stick. It's all about smooth input and also trying to face the ball while going in for your first touch, which is such an important thing in dribbling. And you will find that will help so much more in getting all the executions right simple exits right and the circles again once you receive the ball will give you a good op open output to where you need to go i always tend to think the same way as you would in real life you're trying to drag players into a space by them chasing the ball which a majority of people do and then simply go in the other way as quick as possible it does seem easier said than done but i do recommend watching some of these clips closely and you'll see some of the things I'm on about and how simple it is to sometimes take people out of the game. Like this little touch I'll do here, it's a simple pull back with the left stick and then I push forward with a quick uh, LB boost. And then before I know it, you know, I've left the defender probably with a couple yards of space. If you do want more dribbling tutorials, do sure to uh, hit the like button. And uh, subscribe if you haven't already and I will post more.